Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. On today's video, I am going to be doing a part two um, of how to find hand sanitizer, bleach, Clorox, Lysol, any type of disinfectant that you're looking for. But this time it's gonna be strictly if you're looking online. Me personally, I don't like going into the store. I have small kids. So I try to just get all of my products online and I'm gonna give you guys all of the tips that I use when I'm looking for my products. Um, everything that you see here, I did purchase online. I don't go into the stores for anything before we hop into this video if you are new here welcome to my channel um, make sure that you are subscribed so that way you don't miss anything that I post going forward make sure you give this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below before you leave all right y'all let's hop into the video all right y'all tip number one you want to make sure that you are checking the websites frequently um, when I say frequently I mean like anytime you think about it get on the websites and check um, most of the time they do research stock a lot of the products early in the morning so I say between maybe one o'clock and five o'clock a.m. and sometimes they will restock them um, between the hours of 9 p.m. and 12 a.m. so you can check um, in those late night hours as well and Mondays Tuesdays and Wednesdays are the days that I find I have the most success when I am looking for my products online so just keep that in mind right, tip number two you want to make sure that you are signed up for in stock alerts so we'll use Walmart for example Let's just say you're on the website and you're looking for a specific item and that item is out of stock there will be an option to um, select in stock alerts make sure you click that button anytime you see it put in your email address and what will happen is they'll send you emails anytime that product becomes available and you just want to make sure that you're constantly checking your email so that way you'll be one of the first people to um, click the alert when you get it so you'll have a better chance of getting that product all right tip number three try office supplies stores so don't just go to walmart.com target.com amazon rite aid walgreens try your local office supply stores like office make staples office depot if you guys have one in your area i don't know why people forget that those stores also carry disinfectant and me personally i feel like you have a higher chance of getting them off those websites because people forget about them all right y'all tip number four this is my favorite little treat that i learned how to do um and this is mainly how i got most of my products change your zip code if you find that um if you're going into the stores and they don't have them on the on the shelf nine times out of ten if they're not on the shelf in your stores they're not going to be available online in your area so what you want to do is go in and make sure you're changing the zip code i'm going to leave um some zip codes on the screen and also in the description box that you can use when you're trying to purchase your products um, and it's, it's so simple y'all y'all just go in and update your zip code and then once you get to the checkout menu um, you'll be able to switch it back to your shipping address and put in your correct zip code Alright y'all, tip number five, make sure whatever website that you plan on using, make sure that you go ahead and set up an account with that website and also go ahead and put in all of your information such as your shipping address and also your debit or credit card information. Um, these items tend to become available and go out of stock pretty quickly so you want to make sure that you have all of your info already saved that way if you go online and you see that it is available you can go ahead and add it to your cart and check out without having to put in all that stuff and risk it going out of stock while you're putting in all of your information all right y'all hopefully with some of these tips you'll be able to score some disinfectant of your own let me know down in the comment section if you're able to get any products using these tips um also if you have any tips that you have for me um leave it down below also like i said make sure that you are subscribed so that you don't miss anything that i post going forward and i would really appreciate if you give this video a thumbs up bye y'all